Today, we're teaching you how to make this adorable bat treat box. It's absolutely perfect for Halloween. The best part about this project is that it requires very little supplies. You just need some cardstock and some tape, or you can even use glue dots. Begin by placing your cardstock on a light grip mat and loading it into your Cricut machine for cutting. Be sure to set your Cricut dial to light cardstock, especially if you're working with 65 pound cardstock. Now let's watch it work its magic. Don't forget that the SVG file for this bat treat box can also be used for other cutting machines like the Silhouette. We've linked the SVG file just down below so you can download it right away. We love using this bat treat box for handing out goodies to friends and family. You can fill it with chocolate, candy, mini cookies. The sky is the limit with all of the sweet possibilities. Now it's time to cut the inner portion of the treat box. This piece acts like the lining for the box and makes it a lot more sturdy. It also gives you a chance to add some color to your project. Assembling the box is very simple. You can use a scoring tool to help with your folding, but it's not necessary. In this video, we use scotch tape to help assemble our bat treat box, but you can also use crafter's tape or glue dots. Starting with the main piece, fold in all of the sides. You will want to fold everything inwards. This is where your scoring tool would come in handy, but again, totally not necessary. Fold in all of the sides of the inner liner. We used purple cardstock for ours. Once all of the sides have been folded, set it aside. Grab your bat design again and locate all of the tabs and fold each one in. time for the bat treat box to take shape. Fold all of the sides inwards. Use tape or glue dots to connect and attach each tab to its corresponding side. Now take the inner piece and add tape or glue dots to the bottom of it and slide it right into your treat box. The tops of the box is in the shape of a bat. Each half has a slit and you would use these to close up the treat box. And that is how you
how you put together the cutest little bat treat box. We hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Be sure to check out our other videos for more Cricut crafts.